you already know boys we had to bring this guy right back with the new Mael out making goddesses pretty much meta we have to bring boy bring back the boy Dano snapping Tarmiel man uh if you don't know man Tarmiel is one of the OGs on this channel you will love when I bring this man out because we are going to go crazy so we got to start off with something that you probably remember and can I get a Okay, okay, cause here we go, boys. Are we gonna be using Mael with Margaret and Blue Gilthun in the back now? Blue Gilthun does not work for Mael, but he will work for Margaret and Tarmiel, which is why we're using Dodge Food, so we don't get our our Margaret nuked because that because she is not tanky. But this might be actually pretty cool because how? Oh my God, our team is gonna be super super tanky with my damage reduction on Margaret Tarmiel stance. Oh boy, good luck getting rid of Mael, boys. <laughs> and let's get into it if you guys have any other teams i should try out with my uh comment down below or some pve events uh people have been really liking my uh demonic beast video so keep that in mind all right oh my god tarmiel um you know what i just thought of what if i had used like something like um summer early hawk you know the one that gives you that extra damage reduction yo would that have been like a solid team to use I think that'd be like pretty fire uh thinking about it let's try this out oh no again we're just trying to focus more on tarmiel doing this crazy damage being on the goddess team but i feel like for myself all right it'd probably be better if i use like something like uh summer ellie hawk to match pretty well with the goddess team Hmm, let's see how well can we tank. Let's see. This this is the boy himself. That's dodge food. Cool, cool, cool. Alright. Now I'm gonna push for uh Tarmio's ultimate right here. Just so I can see the, the crazy damage. How much defense does he have right now? 41k. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. That's not bad at all. I feel like with me that Mael is more so to himself than other characters technically. Um, because Light Elizabeth was like a support character for like the entire goddess team. I think Mael is just one of those high DPS characters that will just make the team just work, you know? Alright. How much the stacks do I have? Oh, I don't have that many stacks. All right, let's stack it up then. I'm buffing up twice to increase my Margaret stacks, by the way. For anybody who's like, <laughs> who probably will ask in the comments, like, yo, why did you buff up twice and not attack? I'm just stacking up my Margaret just to see the damage on Tarmio against this goddess team. All right. <laughs> All right, Tarmio, let's see. Thanos, snap. Ooh, okay, he did hit 1 million. He did hit 1 million. I'll take that. I'll take a 1 million. Again, guys, Mayo doesn't really buff other goddess characters like that. It's just that he is so good that you don't you will make goddesses look pretty nice. But remember, his increase all stats is for himself. So it's all about like how much Mayo can do for himself rather than the team. I mean the light attribute thing does like reduce damage, that right? I guess that is pretty cool too. But I still feel like maybe if you use like something like um something like Summer Ellie Hawk, oh my god, the team be like disgusting. I feel like if you use like Summer Ellie Hawk, the team would be disgusting. It's just that him like look at him, like him himself, he's just super tanky. Just because he has all those goddesses. It's like what like you know Meliodas is with the Estrosa team. Like Estrosa. He is that support character, and then Meliodas is the one who's going to be doing all the good old damage. Because, I kid you not, like, if you play against the demons and you get rid of Meliodas first turn, they're going to forfeit, all right? Even if they have, like, Zeldris, Estrosa, and Chandler still there. That's because, that's what Mael is. So, if you get rid of Mael first turn, these guys' teams are going to forfeit. I've seen it too many times. All right, let's finish this off. Ooh. All right, no more HP related stat boost now. 
Oh my gosh, she takes so much crits. Oh my god. Ain't She's still disabled, so her damage is gonna be doing nothing. Oh my god, look at the damage. <laughs> Yo, that damage did nothing. Oh my god, that's sad. Nah, that was sad. Yo, I'm gonna try out Ellie Hawk on this type of team too. With Tarmio having that stance up. Ooh, that's gonna be nasty. That's gonna be nasty. I'm gonna try one more with the blue guild thunder setup. And then I'm gonna try some early health, guys. I just wanna see how nasty it can get. GG, though. Alright, we have demons. They don't know I'm a demon, too. They don't know I'm a demon, too. Uh, that would turn me up my, my big Uda. You feel me? Let's stop playing with him. It's not, they must not know about Tarmio Big Uda. I guess the thing is, like, Meliodas is still, like, really, really good. Um, you back in another stance? <sighs> oh, my God. We can get Tarmio's ultimate. Low key. This dodge food. Let's go. Love our dodge food. Ah, this... Wait, does he know? Because with Goddess Team, with Mayo, like, you can't reduce my stats. He can't, he can't, I'm going to say, like, he can't reduce my stats or anything. Uh, I guess I could do this to him. Just to make him play more aggressive right now. That's because Melios has to, like, literally attack twice to get that attack boost. That's what I'm trying to do right here. I'm trying to force Melios to get, get off his attack boost. And we got a market cleanse. Let's go. Even though it wasn't going to be... Ah, oh, he's going to push for... Ah, oh, he's so greedy. This man is so greedy. Ah, oh, nah. He's so greedy, dude. These Meliodas players are diff diff built different, man. Y'all see, see this? Like, what? This man really wants to, like, blast me with Meliodas right here. Man's rather give up his character. This man gave up his Estrosa just to do this, man. Oh, man. Just so you can attack with Melios one time. He gave up his character just to attack with Melios one time. That, that takes commitment, man. I love these demon players. That takes commitment. He said, yo, instead of me blasting with Meliodas, I'm just going to push for my ultimate. Just so I can take away his gauge. Oh, my God. Wait, he got a gold card? And then Zelda does no damage. Oh, he made sure he debuffed me, too. Ah, he made sure he debuffed me, too. Nah. Ah. Uh, are we serious right now? He got that lucky hand. Oh, that sucks. A gold card with Meliodas is crazy, man. A gold card with Meliodas is crazy. How much stacks do I have right now? Probably better if I just attack... Ah, that's crazy, man. Did y'all see that, man? Him getting a gold card was crazy, man. This would have been GG. This would have been GG. I missed the crit on Zeldris. No! Freaking Bun and Zeldris combo is crazy, man. And he's going to ult me twice, too. Wow, right, here comes his tag boost. These Melios players are built different, dude. These Melios players are built different. He did all this. He did all this for what, man? And he's still taking with my gauge. Dude, they built so different, bro. Like, who who raised these people, bro? Who raised them? Right, I'm just gonna do this then. So we get our final stack then. It should be able to get rid of his Bond and Meliodas. I said Meliodas. It's Eldris. I'm about to say, man. How many crits am I going to miss? And I healed a lot. So he's going to probably attack Margaret right here. Which I have double ultimates. Have fun. Have fun with that. Have fun. Yeah, that's what I thought. GG, man. All this effort just to take a hard L, man. 
Yeah, I gotta see with Ellie Hawk though. But Tarmio did do like no damage. Like, <laughs> freaking Zelda did no damage to Tarmio, which is kind of solid. Obviously, this team with Meliodas out on the field, it makes it very hard to play around with the Tarmio or rushing. All right, we have a goddess team, my favorite. Uh, remember, guys, we're running Ellie Hawk just to test things out. I think Ellie Hawk is gonna be a little bit weaker though, because Tarmio doesn't get that ex extreme defense boost. It's all because we don't have a good support character for uh, um, goddesses right now, which is very unfortunate. Okay. We're just trying to do some good damage to his uh, Sario. Man, one day when we get that support character for goddesses, it's over, man. It's god dang over. Like something in the back that can increase our base stats, man. Because everything that we have that increase base stats for goddesses, you have to use in the front. And those characters that you want to increase your base stats, you don't want to try to use in the front unless they have some some extreme gimmick to them. Like we see with like Rom and stuff being able to pretty much stun. Uh uh uh. Alright, let's try this out. I mean, don't technically tarm me out with his uh, passive, like, lower HP or something like that, based on defense. <sighs> and it doesn't kill. He's not tarm me out in the back, because he would have gained a lot more HP. Yeah, I think he's going to push for his ultimate on me, guys. He wouldn't, right? He would never. He would never, guys, right? Never mind, he did it. Okay. 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 All right. I definitely don't hate myself now. Oh my. Like, I don't know what I can even do right here. I think Mark is probably my best damager right here because he has buffs on him. The only thing is probably is those debuffs that's on me. Mark, you're so butt, man. You're so butt. Margaret, please. Please. One day. Be, can you be good? One day. I know it's hard to I know it's hard to be good, Margaret, for one day. But please. His AoE damage is going to be very weak, though. Um, this is a little Hog passive. And I'm also using Tarmiel to uh, soak up some of that damage as well. Hey, is he 6'6? Six, six? Why is he debuffing again? Let's see his AoE damage without no stance. Garbage. Let's see you. Oh my god, look at those debuffs on me. Garbage. Dang, that's tough. Yo, I think I should just like just just get rid of all that. Yo, that sucks for this guy though. I know he's tight. I know he's upset, man. I know this guy is upset. Let's go for you. It's a good thing, man. He owns the AoE ultimate, man. But now you get to be disabled. Congrats. Congrats. But that did a lot of damage. But we got Tarmia Ultimates. He's disabled. And you have Eskinars, which means you lost your passive. My boy. My king. The only thing he has right now is his freaking... <laughs> Yo, this is not going to save you, buddy. This ain't going to save you, buddy. Yeah, yeah. A gold card is going to save you. There's no way. What do you think is going to happen right here? <laughs> Yo, you're disabled, buddy. Uh, uh, does he want to try it again with his ultimate? I mean, he could. He could try it again. Full heal. 
Dang, man. GG. Tarmio with the Thanos snap. Wow, we got him. Hey, got goddesses, man. And I am the true goddess with Tarmio. And you are scummy. Oh, boy. All right, so Old Rush. Um, so me and my lawyer, uh, we, we figured this might happen. But uh, we will not let this deter us from uh, finish them off. So I have to get rid of Sario first turn. Because he's going to throw up his stance after this. And I'm assuming he has Merlin in the back. So, again, trying to get rid of Sario first is our top priority. So, so, just so he loses passive for Mael. And we can just take away the gauge. All right. Remember, guys, we have Ellie Hawk. We have the Hawkster. All right. So this man's AoE is going to be trash. It's going to be trash. Oh, I thought he would push for... um. Okay. I thought I would see him push for uh, Merle's push for his um double ults. Never mind it then, I guess. I guess we can just stand up right here. I'm actually curious. Is this man 6-6? Six, six? He's not even 6-6. Six, six. Why are you running an ult rush combination? Like, you're not even 6-6. Six, six. Why are you running 6... Why are you running this combination and not even 6-6? Six, six? I'm going to this. Just to put more pressure on them. Obviously, we want to stop Margaret ult, but she's going to disable us. Uh, again, Maya ultimate, I don't really care. <laughs> I don't really don't care about it. I'm just trolling him at this point. Alright, let's see what he does. I mean, if he's not 6'6", six, six, I can also like try to like pressure more Maya than Margaret. Or you're doing no damage. I don't know if you noticed or not. You wasn't doing no damage. All right. It's not even, what? What is this combination? Why are you running old rush? Y'all see what I'm seeing? Like, why are you running old rush and you have like low dupe characters? Am I tripping? Am I tripping saying this? Like, I'm just mad confused about this. I guess the good thing about goddess teams is like they can run like rich army gracious or everybody so they're, they're kind of in limited options on what they can do what they can't do uh-huh you're gonna aoe ultimate did you, did you forget the introduction oh he even crit me didn't take away half my hp wow that's tough. All right, we got demons. Ooh. Ooh, not the demons. Not the demons. We wouldn't want the demons to strike. And um, I guess I can do this as well. It's probably gonna be my last one. Because we've been having so much fun with this uh, Tarmiel combination, man. I love Tarmiel. All right, this man just been eating good. Obviously, with Blue Guild Thunder, it is what you really want until we get maybe that support character that can boost base stats. Uh, but I did like this team. It was pretty fun. Obviously, Meliodas, who gets like that extreme attack boost, is going to be troublesome. But that's fine. That's totally fine. Uh, because we have we have the boy Tarmi. We have Tarmi right here, all right, to support us and all all our harshness. Uh, I'm doing this. You don't want to give Melio's attack boost unless you're about to get rid of him first turn right here. And again, this is the last one, so you know I gotta make this special. I can't even buff over right here technically. Chandler, you're doing no damage, sir. I have too much damage reduction right now. Uh, I guess what I could do right here is debuff. Ooh, he was close. He was close to getting rid of me. So we can just debuff right here. Uh, again, buffing up isn't going to do anything for me because he will get rid of it. All right, let's see his damage right now. We got one sunspot on him. Ugh, 501. Big boy damage right there. Big boy damage. 
I mean, I like the Tarmio combination. Again, I just wish it was like better supports. Obviously, Ellie Hawk is cool, but I'd rather have base that boosting rather than damage reduction. Wait, oh my god, wait. Uh, yo, we think we can. Uh, Y'all think it's possible, guys? Y'all see? Y'all see what I'm seeing right now? Y'all think it's possible? I think I need to get like my ultimate right here. I just want to see how much damage you can do to, to uh, Zelda's bottom soul right here. Cause you get like extra twenty percent base death right here. I low key want to see. I low key just want to see how much you can do with time to uh, Zelda's bottom soul right here. Just so I get a good old laugh. Wow, he did no damage. Nah, that's crazy. How much does he have right now? Oh nah, he just has a lot of damage reduction going on for himself. Oh my god. I just want to see how much he's going to do uh, to Zelda by himself. Nothing special. You know how much I love Tarmiel, so I might as well have a little bit of fun with this. Again, we do have 20% base stats right now. Oh my god, Zelda's doing no damage right there. Nah, that's crazy. How, how much do you think this is going to do? I think it will do like maybe uh, 2 million to this guy. I don't know. Or a million. Just by himself. I overshot it, man. I overshot it. But well, I hope you guys, you guys enjoyed this video. This really guys, and I'm out. Peace. Yeah, I definitely overshot that one. I said a million. No way.